everyone! This is a video tutorial for the oxidation of a secondary alcohol. So as you see over here, we're going to take our secondary alcohol and react it with sodium hypochlorite and acetic acid at a temperature of 0 degrees Celsius. The actual reaction does happen with HOCl, it's just that HOCl is unstable. So we're going to use these two reagents here to make it in situ. Once this reaction happens, we're going to get a ketone out. This whole mechanism happens by an SN2 pathway. Let's take a look at that. Okay, so let's take a look at the mechanism. So over here we have our secondary alcohol. As always, the first step is to activate that OH group so that we're able to proceed with the reaction as we go. So over here, the oxygen with its lone pairs will come and attack this hydrogen, causing the bond to break and for those electrons to shift onto the O. So over here, we form a protonated alcohol. The next step is an SN2 step where this group right here, our hypochlorite, will come and attack this carbon, kicking off the protonated alcohol group. So now over here we formed this group here. So next, an unspecified base in solution will come and it will take that hydrogen. Those electrons will now shift to form a double bond between this carbon and this oxygen. The formation of that double bond precipitates the chlorine group getting kicked off. So at the end we formed our ketone, a protonated base, and our chloride anion. And that's what that mechanism looks like.